at this, I studied the life of successful, according to, you know, human definitions, you know, heads of industry, entrepreneurs, leaders of big institutions, prime ministers. I searched and researched their lives, and I found certain traits. You know, they are all early raisers. They wake up very early, all of them, almost unanimous. They wake, I read, you know, between 4 o'clock and 6 o'clock is their wake-up time. Although work starts at 9. Yet they wake up early. So what do you do? They don't answer emails. They wake up and they meditate. Or they read what they call motivational texts. To inspire them for the rest of the day. To, you know, to pick them up. And what do you do? Or what did the dean prescribe for you to do in the morning? After you have said, you know, your hamd, you wake up, you do your wudu. You stand in salah and fajr is long recitations. Of the most motivational text man is ever to know the divine word of Allah himself. And then you sit and do your wird, your adhkar. Try this for those of you who haven't. Try to sit and do your adhkar for 30 minutes, you know, before you go. See what it does to you for the rest of the day. I do my word in the car in these days because, you know, Fajr is late. And I tell you, and I don't say this, you know, to blow my own trumpet, but I, by the time I get to work, my heart is dancing. Like, Allahu Akbar, let's go. Why? Because the deen was made to give you the best of this life and the best of the next. 